Hey everyone, today I'll be playing a, a new deck, or not a new deck, uh, pretty cool deck, uh, metal, I just called it metal, metal, it revolves around this Dialga, this Bronzong, this Age Slash, pretty much this Bronzong is, uh, the main focus of the deck. It basically has Manetrix, uh, Dynamotor, Manetrix, same ability, except for metal. So you get to attach discard, or metal from your discard, onto any adventure Pokemon. Um, Mm, yeah, that's it for uh, so that's maximum with the three three line around. That's three energy per turn I can get. Excuse me, uh, maximum to take advantage of this. You're going to be running one kill DX with Russian, two float stone because we can only attach to the bench. So we want to promote kill deal and uh, get the um, energy onto the bench Pokemon. I'm running two float stone because of. Um, Wrongzong is uh, something that we don't want caught in the active. So I do run two. I also run, um, I believe, one switching card. I don't know. I'll, we'll go through the deck though. So one kill the UX. Y'all know what this do. Drong, uh, Dialga. Full metal impacts what you'll be using most of the time. Um, two metal, two colorless, 150 damage. Discard two metal from his Pokemon and Chrono Wind. The gloves come to the attack, but still pretty good attack. 60 damage, and the defending Pokemon, if it is in the EX, it cannot attack during your next turn. Pretty good. Age Slash, also pretty good. It is a uh, very good role in the metagame we have right now. It's attack Slash Blast, is Kelly UX's attack. But 5 less base damage and uses metal. Mighty Shield is a. Uh, Mighty sh Sorry, Mighty Shield. Prevents all damage. Do Age Slash. Um, from Pokemon with Special Energy. That's really good. Um, it's basically safeguard. Except it basically immunity to like every single deck because uh, Plasma have their uh, Prisms and or Rainbow or whatever, and their uh, Plasma Energy. Um, um, Genesect have their. Genesect has their plasma energy, fairy has their rainbow energy, and uh, fighting has their strong energy, and after Primal Clashes, this deck will have their special metal, special metal energy. Um, yeah, so it's pretty much a wall against everything in the format. One Jirachi, one Mr. Mime, uh, two event bench damage, two Rongzong, four type of colorless, eight metal, we'll get research, I think, uh, most... Sorry, most uh, A specs works pretty well in this deck. Scramble Sish works decently well. Uh, Scoob of Cyclone works decently well. Um, computer Search, Dowsing Machine, Master Ball, whatever card. Uh, basically, if you have an A spec, Computer Search and Dowsing Machine are probably the best, but if you have an A spec, just put it in. There's really no point not to. Uh, it will be pretty good. 4N, 2 Lysander, 1 Secret Dash, 2 Super Scoob of. Uh, the reason I want to run Super Scoop Up is basically because if we have like a Danish Dialga, we can uh, Super Scoop it up, put up either a uh, prepared Dialga or a uh, powered up Dialga, um, and then just, um, I'm sorry, um, either a powered up Dialga or something that has a float zone attached to it. Uh, like Keldeo preferably, and then we'll be able to uh, just uh, put it down, use metal links, um, and um, have a fully healed Pokemon. Um, yeah, <laughs> Heal Shelter. Uh, basically, Verizon EX in a trait stadium form, and only for metal Pokemon. Um, to be a seeker standard for Professor Juniper, 3 Ultra Ball, 2 Floatstone. One hypno toxic laser because uh, full metal impact. If you notice, only does 150 damage. And to fix that, we run a muscle band because uh, most popular Pokemon have 170 HP. And then hypno toxic laser takes in versus that like a uh, few Pokemon that have 180 HP. For Qualos, because we want to have full bench and two Shauna. That is the deck list. Um, of course, as always, you can find this on TCG One. What I use instead of a Pokemon trading card game online for my um, playing Pokemon trading card game. It's online because uh, this is 
gives you all the cards for free. Um, right off the bat, you don't have to buy packs. I know it supports the game, but whatever. Um, so by this point, we're just waiting for the game. Basically, the point of the deck is to accelerate your energy with a Bronze on and Viola, um, discards two metal per turn with the full metal impact if you can get it off every turn and you just keep recycling the Yogas with a super scoop up to um just d deal a steady stream of 170 damage uh I've seen this work out pretty well and by this point we're just waiting for a game uh <laughs> speaking of which starting out with a age slash and I guess we'll just put a Keldia down. So again, Age of Slash is pretty much the perfect wall. Um, <laughs> versus uh, anything. Sex is actually uh, sort of better in the expanded format because you can use the black and white, black and white, um, excuse me, black and white cling clang that, uh, sorry can move energy around while well, we're playing against a uh, Gengar deck this is going to be interesting it's pretty much guaranteed to go up against they're not going to attach three normal psychic energy so each slash can just sort of wall for now I think they take the poison damage I can read that one uh, puts down his Pokemon and he starts his turn I think I don't know if I'm going first I'm player A yeah, so I'm going first. This deck sort does benefit from going first because you can't attack on the first turn. There's no way for you to attack on the first turn, really. I don't. Like, I guess you could do something blacksmith or whatever with Age Slash, but uh, you're not gonna be able. You're not gonna be able to attack on the first turn. <laughs> so, oh no. Gonna suck. Immediately get the float some. Um. Yeah, it's gonna not be fun. So playing a Gengar Zubat deck. It's the first I've seen of that Gengar Zubat. Uh, basically, there's a Gengar Crobat. Basically, there's a Crobat in the f Furious Fist. Maybe I think that uh, just. I actually can check this on my 3DS. See if I can find it. Um, the idea is from. Yeah, I can't tell. My 3DS. Uh, sorry about that. I honestly don't know what that's from. Uh, so. Do I get off a damage with the double colorless energy? I don't know. Flash flash. Or no my shield friends all did it's all damage. Doesn't go away update. No, I don't want I don't know. Okay, so it's all damage. So it's still take poison. This uh crowbat could also be a different crowbat from Plasma Storm. If you need to go look it up, but basically what it does is you draw an car extra card each turn, and it allows you to, um, sorry, it uh, allows you to go through, um, or no, allows you to, for 3 energy, it does 40 damage, and then 40 more from poison, because it does 4 damage in between turns, instead of the 3 that, um, Toxic Croak has. That's why one of these days I'm just gonna croak. How do you deal three damage? What? Oh, it's damage counters, not damage, whatever. Stupid ruling. Sh hate you. Um. <laughs> going to attach. Go away, Norton. I don't want you. I don't belong here. I'm going to attach this to Dialga. 
on my turn. I think next turn I'm going to either. Depends on what I top deck. If I top deck uh, metal energy or something that's uh, I want to discard, not want to discard something that's useless. I think I'm going to go for a Bronzong, whatever it's called. Um, it's actually uh, going to attach three energy to attack and only deal poison damage. No, it's just going to go in and deal poison damage. He only does ten damage turn. So, I don't know what he's planning to do. He just played by his air's junk card, that dirty bitch. That's also one of the issues with the deck. It's last standard jump card. I hate that card. Um, <laughs> when you're playing metal, you, trust me, you do not want to go up against a deck that plays last standard jump card. If you are playing a metal deck, you're just not fun. I know, I have played both against it and with it. It is not fun. <laughs> It's not fun to watch them struggle to try and get energy into the discard pile after it's all in their deck. That's one of the reasons to draw a battle compressor. Uh, I didn't bring a battle compressor earlier. Um, battle compressor? Oh, of course. Definitely. Uh, I'm gonna do this, and this, and the. Uh, what do I do here? I think I'm going to touch to Dialga again. And dead my turn. I think that's pretty much all I can do for now. Um <laughs> So I think it's gonna be a crowbat with a uh, sneaky bite, but it's gonna be a crowbat with a uh, Ultra Toxic Fang. I think is what it's called, Ultra Toxic Fang. Uh, which basically you just deal 40 from poison and 40 from damage. Uh, I've actually wanted to make something with that. Actually, did I make that on here? No, I didn't have any green at uh, Tux Croak. Command Z uh, Crobat. I had to delete it, I think. Yeah, um, still have no idea what this guy's playing. I know it was Gengar Toxic Croak, which is fairly common, and that's really. <laughs> Not, um... That is that, Dialga. You have a hand of six. I think the one of those card is gonna be worth it. Um... I should put a... One, no. Case of, uh... What is it called? Start on the microphone. I want the, um... Caldeo to have... The Float Stone. So, yeah, um... I'll just be able to rush in and retreat next turn, because I'll be able to... Oh, I don't have that. Oh, uh, I can actually... Be a seeker for a chorus and get nine cards. So, I will be able to <laughs> get the full mountain back, and if he does not play Star on the microphone, hopefully he does not, uh, I will be able to... take a knockout and get rid of all his energy, because he doesn't have any other energy in play. So I'll be able to take a shield to take all of his energy this turn out of play if he does not play a strong microphone. I think he realizes this now. <laughs> that I may be able to knock him out or it's just not doing anything because he's just... Oh, okay. Yeah, that's the way to win. Let's play on my 3DS. I actually restarted my game <laughs> and uh, I'm playing again. Come on! I want to start off this deck in a good game. Don't do this, man. Don't do this, man. Come on! Uh, worst way to win. I think that was the first game I played. I'm not sure. Let's check. Sorry about this. That was the first game I played. So. Metal, let's play again. It's just really boring waiting for this. So, if we didn't disconnect, what I would have done there was uh, get the wrong song out and um, full metal impacted.
for two one hundred seventy damage if you didn't place it in the mega zone. And win the game from there. Um or just try and win the game from there with using Kelly or Russian and retreat with metal links and manual attaches because they uh, actually filled my bench up. And yeah, um no, I think I showed off the deck good enough. I don't want to play more than one game. So, yeah, bye. See you guys later. I should have a shift tree deck uh, that I will be playing. So, see you guys later.